Hello, Internet! I'm HamsterBomb, and you are back for a brand new Shiny Pokemon series. Actually, probably, if you don't count, like, my actual Shiny Hunts, this is its own new Shiny Pokemon series, and this is, this is unbelievable. I actually, as you see, just started a brand new copy of Heart Gold, and I've already talked to my mom and checked up on one thing that I really needed to see, and it's actually on the bottom screen right now, but my trainer ID is the correct number that I needed. And I know that's going to sound kind of weird at first, and the title of this episode, I'm just going to ignore them for now because they're going to do all the intro to the beginning of the game stuff, because I really need to explain what's going on. This is an unbelievable game, if it will work. I honestly don't know if it'll work. If you guys actually see this on YouTube, it means it probably worked, or I'm making a video making fun of myself thinking it was going to work. So, um, oh my gosh. Can't wait till I get running shoes, by the way, just a random thing, but, um, okay. Wow, I was supposed to go in here, right? My nuts, my, my stupid here. Hi, hamster, I've been waiting for you. You know anything about my research? As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeballs these days. I don't really need to say what he's saying. I really need to explain what's going on with this series, because this series, uh, as you can tell by the title, this, if it works, this is the single luckiest game ever. It is. This is the luckiest game ever. I finally got the trainer ID that I wanted, and what I can do with it, combined with the correct secret ID, is, in theory, use a Pokemon that has the ability Keep Charm, which I actually have ready in another game I'm going to trade over to swap out for our starter that we're going to pick in just a moment. And, in theory, this will use a glitch that is in the fourth generation games, all fourth generation games as far as I'm aware, which counts Heart Gold, Soul Silver, and, you know, all the other, you know, Diamond, Pearl, Platinum. And that is, if uh, you have a specific Trainer ID and Secret ID, Pokemon will shine for you about, uh, like, a, a, about in this game, I think it might even go up to about 20%. I'm not even kidding, about 20% of the time we might find shiny Pokemon. This might be unbelievable. I've tried doing this before for a friend for another game, and he did get a version of it working, and he had about, like, um, 1 out of 30 or so Pokemon would show up and shine, which... That's still amazing if it can work, if we can get it to work. And if we can get it to work, guys, I know I'm not choosing our starter quite yet, but if we can get it to work, I have uh, normal, normal, normal. I did want to check before we actually, you know, went in here and said, all right, I'm just going to pick a, a Cyndaquil. Mainly I'm picking a Cyndaquil in honor of the fact that, one, I found a shiny Cyndaquil. It was one of my first ever shinies. You guys can go back and watch that video. It was awesome when I started my last playthrough of um, Heart Gold. And, oh my gosh, the memories, the memories. But anyway, um, traditionally, um, actually do not, do not need to nickname him at all. It doesn't matter. So, what was I saying? So, I need to get that cute charm Pokemon in order to test that this whole thing is going to work, because if it doesn't, we're going to fall through, and I don't know what kind of odds we're going to get for finding shiny Pokemon out the wazoo. Um, so it looks like, I think from the beginning of the game, we have to go find Mr. Pokemon, who I know where he is, we just have to survive to get over there, and get the ability to trade. And as soon as I can trade, like I said, I'm going to be trading our Cyndaquil over, and yeah, traditionally, I think gold is supposed to pick the Cyndaquil, so silver picks the Totodile. I don't know. North Little Pass Cherry Grove, I'm counting on you, hamster. So, while we're walking around with our, with our Cyndaquil, I'm going to explain a little bit of what I have in mind for a game like this. Like, what do you do with a game where shiny Pokemon show up all the time? Now, people might think, like, well, it's, it's te isn't that technically cheating? I mean, that's... I mean, yeah, sure, you kind of have to do a little bit of, I guess, cheating to get it to happen, but it's a glitch. This is... I'm not using any cheats. I actually could move my camera, and you can see the back of my DS. There are no glitch... There's nothing back there. Nothing. There's nothing in that thing. And that's really because I'm not cheating right now. This is a glitch in the game. So, um, you gotta blah, 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 talk to Lyra. God, sometimes that's right. Show to your mom. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You do have to go talk to your mom before you leave. So, I'm gonna go do that really quick. So, and like I said, how do you, if it works, assuming it works, oh, dear God, please work. I'd be so happy. I've been wanting to start this series for months, guys. Months. Hey, Mommy! Wanna see my city quill? Yes, sir, it's a cute Pokemon you have. Uh, give it to you. Of course, I have a task. You say, what kind of task? Mm, of course, the, the task you have tasks. I'm just gonna leave you forever and go find all the Pokemon. The shiny Pokemon. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. But, oh, I received Poke Gear. Yeah, we couldn't leave without that. That is important. Yes, 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 Mother. But anyway, um, do you remember? Yes, I I remember. You don't have to tell me. Just pound on the po She told me anyway. Alright, Mom, I really want to hurry up. 
Yes, it's so easy to make a phone call. Anyway, so. In a world where you can just find shiny Pokemon out the wazoo, how does one retain interest in an entire series, you say? Well, says Hamster. Look. Everyone's interrupting me, aren't they? Well, my plan. I, because of having this newfound power, this glitch, I will not go to new routes in this game, if they're accessible, until I have captured every single shiny Pokemon that I can in that route. And that includes the 1% finds, because this game actually has a lot of really incredible 1% finds. Now, don't think that we're going to be finding any shinies while we're on our way here. For one, that would stink, we don't have any Pokeballs. And for two, I don't have my shiny, or I'm not, sh not shiny, I do not have my Jigglypuff out. And I, we really should be fighting, shouldn't we? Because we have to be at our rival to get on the way back here. So, if anything, I, I guess I'm just going to keep talking until I can kind of get all of my information out that I'm trying to tell you guys about this series. Because I'm so excited, I'm so excited to do this! Alright, Cindy, I'm sorry I didn't name you or anything, but uh, we are going to need some fire moves so we can start beating those, you know, buggies up there. Oh, oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited to play this game because, okay, so this first area, think about it. Getting all of the shinies in it, what does that constitute? Well, first of all, there's Pokemon that show up only at nighttime. There's Pokemon that show up only in daytime. There's also a smaller route if we go up towards the top. There's so many Pokemon that can show up. So even if they are showing up at a higher rate, who knows what our rate is going to be, we are at least going to be finding them. And I'm pretty confident that this trainer ID is actually going to be giving us all of them. Very confident because of the... There's the normal sentry. I don't know why I was expecting that to be shiny for some reason. <laughs> Alright, so let's at least keep leveling up our Cyndaquil. Um, I'm going to keep going through the game, get up to Mr. Pokemon, and um, I'm hopefully going to get back with you guys and hopefully uh, trade over my Jigglypuff, who's named Magic, by the way. Male Jigglypuff, because I believe to get this to work with this particular trainer ID, I need a female... No. A male Jigglypuff, which then gives us all male... No. I got that backwards. All male Jigglypuff, which will cute charm out all female shiny Pokemon. Um, in theory, because even though I, I'm pretty sure males still appear, right? I don't know. I don't really know how it's gonna work. We're just gonna find out. This is seriously a learning experience for me too, and guys, I know nothing about this. This is basically new. I've never seen anyone ever do this on anything other than a ROM, because it's really easy to cheat it on a ROM. I obviously wasn't doing the cheating part, trying to make this a completely legitimate game, which is why it took so long for me to do this, and honestly, my videos on my channel, I shiny hunted a lot before I actually started doing these videos on the channel, so I stockpiled a ton of them up, and then by the time I started making more YouTube stuff, I was releasing shiny Pokemon videos about once every week or so, they go up on Sundays now. And I just realized recently, hey, I'm almost out of these. Like, almost out of them. And after I got Shiny Articuno, I was like, oh no. Guys, I only have one more Shiny after this that I can show you, and after that, I don't know what to do. Because, I mean, like, I knew I really wanted to try this. Le oh, Cynical got Smokescreen. Well, yay. So I knew I really wanted to try this method, uh, try and get it to work on an actual game that's, you know, completely legitimate. Oh my god. There's that other route that I can't wait to explore as soon as we get this working. If it works, oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so excited. Oh, do you believe in magic? That's gonna be the name of my Jigglypuff as soon as we start using it. Magic. I'm so, so excited. So, um, I don't want to rant on forever, but it sounds like you guys basically got the gist of what's going on in my game. Oh, winky winky. So, I'm gonna hurry up and probably cut to the point where I have to take down my, um, What's his name? Uh, the uh, my rival, Silver. Do I get to name him? I don't know. But my name is Hamster. I should name him Bomb. Traditionally, I should name him Bomb. So, if we can at least get to that point, that would be pretty awesome. And after that, I believe I'm going to be allowed to trade. And if I'm allowed to trade, I'm going to trade the Cyndaquil over and go right back to the very first route where I'm allowed to start capturing Pokemon. And I will see you guys in the first route of shiny Pokemon, and it's gonna be amazing. Alright guys, apparently that took way longer than expected. I had to do a lot more than just beat my rival. I had to catch a lot of Pokemon in order to trade with myself for Platinum. And, yeah. I had to catch uh, as many as I could, and honestly, I just caught a bunch of Pidgeys. Please, let me trade this time. Yes! I tried this before, and it didn't work. Oh, I'm so excited. We're finally gonna get magic in our game. Magic is about to happen. This is gonna be glorious. So we're going to trade our Cindy Quill. I could have sworn I caught another Pidgey. Why did I not catch another Pidgey? Ah, dang nabbit, I thought I caught another one. Oh well. As you can see, well you will see in a bit, I'm going to be trading.
for um, several other Pokemon that I want to trade over from my Platinum game because my Platinum game is actually really unsafe. Like It's really rare to get it to read in my game. So I want to get the Shinies that are in it out of it. And who's in it right now, mostly that I really want to save is Celsius, my Shiny Articuno. But first, the obvious, most important, the ver that I said I will be trading the starter for, Magic. The uh, shiny, um, no, not shiny. The magic Jigglypuff. Magic is a magic Jigglypuff. And if all goes well, this Jigglypuff, while it is in the front of the party using its ability Q Charm, will let me find shiny Pokemon easily. Maybe. I don't know yet. It's still just a theory. I don't know if it's going to work or not, but at the very least, I tried. I did all this work to try and get to this point. Seriously, guys, this has been months. I'm not kidding. Just try and get to this point. This is so important. Okay, so... Magic has arrived in the game. And Magic is at level 17, I think, so it's actually going to be okay for trying to catch these Pokemon. Because, like I said, I do want to trade over some other Shinies of mine from my Platinum game. I'm not going to cheat or use them or anything. They are going to stay in the box until I'm at an adequate level where I can actually start using them. Like, I'd like to raise my Shiny Articuno, but that's obviously going to wait till level 50 becomes a thing, which is probably going to wait till like, Kanto. But... And now, um, I'm going to finish trading these Pokemon over, and I'm going to see you guys in the grass. Alright guys, the moment is finally upon us. We have Magic with us. Hi Magic, how you feeling? You feeling good? Magic is glowing with health. And that's not all that Magic should be glowing with. Oh man. Oh man. I really want to try and make our way to um, this uh, one part of the route. Woo! Alright, good. We actually did not stumble across anybody there. Because, uh, who knows what we might have found. But I really want to go up in here. Because these are some of my favorite, uh, Pokemon that we can run into. And honestly, I want to finish this part first. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Here we go, guys. Here we go. I mean, if this works, I'm going to be so happy. And if it doesn't, I mean... I don't know. I'll, I'll just be really bummed. But, you know what? At the very least, I tried. So, Magic, you just pulled in a male. <laughs> Why? Magic, don't tell me that your magical cute charm abilities don't work. Though I was saying earlier, I think it can still find males. I don't really understand why. And, um, oh, there's a female. Whatever that means. So, honestly, I think for this video, we need to at least find two shinies if we can even find one at all. Because we need to prove that it's not a fluke. We need to prove that this is real if it's working at all. We found three Geodudes. Hey, if we find a Geodude, I will put it on my team. That'd be awesome. I'd love to have a Geodude. I made a list of a bunch of Pokemon that I'd love to raise in this game as I'm going through it, root by root, trying to catch all the Shinies. My gosh, this is amazing. It's a gotta catch them all shiny style. That's so cool. There's a Spearow. Still nothing. Come on, Magic. Come on, Magic. I believe in you. Please don't make me look like a fool on the internet. I tried so hard. It's been months, Magic. Oh, I hope, I really hope it's working. It'd be amazing. There's a normal Rattata as, as again. Not exactly sure how I'm going to be catching the Pokemon either if it does appear. Because I went back, I caught, I went back and bought 10 more Pokeballs. We do have those at the very least, so that's nice to have. Came with a Premier Ball, so we got a lot of tries. I don't know how well Magic is going to let us, you know, go for these Pokemon. Maybe it knows Sing. That would help a lot. Um... Still not finding any, you know. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Guys, I think it's working! Oh my god, no way! Shiny Spiro! I don't even have this shiny! Oh my god, I'm so Oh, wow! What do we know? Fight! Okay, we have Defense Curl, Pound, Disable, and Roll Out. That's all really, really dangerous. So... Oh my god. Oh my gosh, my head. Oh my god. This is real. This is freaking real. Alright, let's use a Pokeball. I have not, nothing else I can do. But we can start fighting with this Spiro if this works. One. No. Oh my god, it sparkles again. Oh yes! Oh my god. This is gonna be an amazing game. This is gonna be an amazing game. I can't believe this is real. This is happening. This is really happening. I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be able to get every single Pokemon as a shiny. Okay, not all of them. Don't take that out of context that I can get anything, because that's not true. Oh, I can only get, um, Pokemon that can change genders, 
I think. Um, I, like, say something like Ditto or certain genderless Pokemon, it's just not gonna work on them. <laughs> Stop breaking out on my balls, though. I really need you. Okay, so, I don't know why it's being so stubborn. Oh, it's Cute Charm infatuated my Spearow. Okay, well, anyway, so th there's a lot of Pokemon that it does not work for, and it obviously doesn't work on, like, legendaries. You can only use q Charm where you normally could before. You can't do it on, like, Gift, Pokemon, it's only stuff in the wild. I believe. Oh, he's so cute! You love me so much, Spiro. It's a golden Spiro. Oh my god, I'm s Oh, I got it live! Oh my god, if it's- if it was a fluke, which... I'm hoping it wasn't. I'm really hoping it wasn't. You don't know how much it would mean to me if... Why am I using all my Pokeballs on this? I'm not gonna be able to catch anything else. Guys, that was all my money! What am I gonna do? Come on, please! Stay in the ball, Spiro. One. Two. Three! Yes! We caught Shining Spiro! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm switching... Well, actually, no, I can't switch him, can I? Because, um, the magic ability only works if magic is out front. So to find another Pokemon and prove that this is indeed working, to end this episode... Give a nickname to Spiro? Yes, actually. Um... Wow. Wow. I know you're all probably thinking the same thing I'm thinking. I should name it after Pecker from uh, Pokemon Randomizer, but this is a female. In which case, I will have to give her a different nickname of, um... Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Give me a minute, I'm gonna think of a good name. <laughs> I named her Pecky. Actually, uh, all my Ocarina Hero fans will know what that's from. That is a... Wow. Oh, my game actually changed to night now. Well, I wonder if we'll find new Pokemon. Well, we... I, I'm taking a look at my, my Pecky, my brand new shiny Spiro. Oh my gosh, it's a hardy nature. Um, I don't know if that, like, matters at all with my ID. I, I remember reading that certain IDs will give you certain natures, so I know that's one reason that it might be different. Um, but that does give me better hope that this won't be as insanely rare as my friend's game, because he was trying to find this, he would look forever to try and find shinies. And I think it was because his were solely quirky. Every time it appeared, it was always a quirky. So that was weird. So we have a hardy. I don't know if it's like always hardy or something. Hardy is, um, actually neutral. I had to like look over and look at that, I wasn't sure. Keen eye is its ability. Oh my gosh, I might actually might actually raise that, I don't know. I'm so excited. So excited! Just because it was our first one, if it really, if this really keeps up, I really want to find a shiny Geodude, if it really is working. There's a regular Geodude. Oh my gosh, I'm s Oh my- Guys, you have no idea how excited I am. I've been doing this for months, trying to get this working. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Magic. Magic is happening in this game. There's a normal Rattata, so it looks like our options in here I could have sworn there was more to it than that. Um, I was really excited about going back in here because I know you can find Spearows and Geodudes really early. And both of which are very good on your team. So I would like to add them, if possible, if Geodude was going to be a nice guy and shine for us. I don't know how well a um, Spearow is going to fare against it, especially with flying type moves. Maybe that's a bad idea, but at the very least we can do some damage, right? Or maybe my uh, level 17 Jigglypuff can hit Pound on it, but I'd feel like I'm going to kill it if that was the case. I don't know. Oh my gosh, is... We're not finding anything else. Was that a fluke? Was it a fluke? We're not finding anything else! Uh oh. Oh gosh. I am getting a little worried. My eye just got really itchy too. I'm getting really worried. Was that it? Maybe the chances are like... Actually really low or... Mi We're not finding another one. Okay, well, okay, I... Man, if it's gonna be this hard, if this is working and it's like this, how am I gonna get all these, like, 1% shiny finds? Yeah, this is insane. This ain't working. Is this working? Guys, I think we got lucky. No way. Did I really just, like, find a shiny Spearow and not really care? In the beginning of my game, too, I just started. Nope. A second Shining Spiro. Now, unfortunately, it's another Spiro, but it does at least show that it's working. Oh my gosh, it is working. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited, guys. 
Oh my gosh. Now, because I'm now confident that it's working, I'm surprisingly... I'm actually gonna run from this Spiro and keep looking and uh, talk about the rest of this because if it's... if I can really farm them like that, I can go back and get them at any time and I don't want it to feel like I'm... <gasps> oh! That's new! One after another! Oh my god! Shining Radata! Wow! I don't have that shiny either! That's so amazing! That's so amazing! Oh my gosh! Oh, it looks so cool! It looks so good! Actually, let's switch Pokémon over to Pecky. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, I'm so... Shiny Spiro! And... Sh oh my god! Oh my god! This is the luckiest... The luckiest game ever! Oh my god! Dude, don't you kill him! No! Ah, uh, at least I got some damage on it before- Oh, that's it! Oh, please, don't quick attack. Please don't. Oh, no, 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 don't kill me, don't kill me. Oh, no. Well, that's not good. We're gonna use next Pokemon. We are indeed. We're gonna send magic back out and make some magic happen with some Pokeballs. Let's see what we can do here. We have five more. Five more, guys. Can we catch a level four Rattata? No, we can't because it's freaking shiny. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh my god, I can't believe this. So, I'm not really sure what exactly to do in terms of filming for the rest of this series. Um, I might... I I'm not sure. I I'm really, I'm not sure about this, like, how I want to handle it. Three? No! Oh, don't tease me like that! We only have three more Pokeballs, guys. We might fail this. I mean, as if it really matters, I can always go back and he's not too hard to find, but you saw it. It kind of took a long time to even find him. So, imagine finding the shiny of a 1% in an area. One. Wow! Oh my god. Oh my god, this is amazing. This is... This is unbelievable that this is even happening. I can't... We only have two more tries. This might fail. Oh no, I might fail. I'll come back. I'll come... One. Two. Three! Success! Yes! We have a new shiny on our team, guys. Two acquired in our first episode. Oh my, I'm so, so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Uh, like I said, I'm not exactly sure. I'm probably going to um, do this in terms of roots. Like, we'll see uh, root one complete root, except they're not in those number orders, but whatever roots they are completed in a certain order. I'm obviously gonna be raising some of these shinies offline too. I'm gonna name you. Oh, I'm naming you Joey. I am naming you Joey, and everybody knows why. There we go. Youngster Joey. Ah, uh, the greatest of... Oh, I actually get to fight Youngster Joey in this game. Be the bomb. Oh, let's take a look at our new... Shiny Rattata. He is docile. And he hates to lose. Um, that is also neutral. Wow, okay. That's weird. That's weird. Like, I don't understand how it's working. But it's working. Oh my gosh. Guys, one episode... Live, we just found three shiny Pokemon, technically. I ran from a Spearow. Which, good thing that wasn't another fluke, too. Two golden shiny Pokemon. Alright, guys, I actually just checked online and found out that we can actually complete this route, uh, which is Route 46, by finding the Geodude. And that will be our final one. And I can say for our first episode, Route 46 complete! Which would be amazing, because it would be our first route. I'm so glad. I mean, fortunately... We actually got really lucky in that Rattata was a 25% find. Now, the Geodude is a 40, so we really should find Shiny Geodude for our episode, which would be amazing if we- Oh! Oh, it looks so good! Look at it! This is unbelievable! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Do I attack it? I think I'm gonna switch to our newly acquired Joey. See if we can do a little bit of damage to it. Oh my god, it looks so good! Oh, it looks so good! Defense curl. I also don't have a shiny Geodude. I'm... wow. Uh, I think Quick Attack actually does a little bit more damage. Tail Whip might be a good idea. But he just used Defense Curl. It would negate it, I guess, right? Tail Whip, let's lower his defense so we can negate that at the very least and try and do some sort of damage to him. Stop it, Geodude! Oh, man. 
Oh my god. Let's just keep this up. Okay, so at the very least, nothing has happened so far in this fight. Gee, it, you're... Should I attack? <sighs> Let's try it. Oh my god. Oh my god, a shiny... Wow. No, we need a... We need a tail whip. We need a tail whip. Oh, we need a tail whip badly. Whip that tail, Joey. Whip it like you just don't care. Oh. Oh god. Stop it! Hopefully that's only one stage. Oh my gosh, guys. We... I don't know what to say anymore. I'm so baffled. That was... We only... Oh, shoot, we only have, like, one Pokeball left, don't we? Oh, God, how are we gonna do this? We gotta catch it! What if we fail? Oh, no, we only have, like, one Pokeball left! I gotta attack, what am I doing? But I'm not gonna do any damage! Oh, no. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do! I'm doing something, at the very least. I'm doing something. I will whittle him down. Please oh, no, it's not doing anything! Uh-oh. Come on, Joey. You're the man. Critical hit, Joey. The only time you want a critical hit against a shiny. Nothing. Oh, God. Oh, God. Why do you attack me now? Oh, no. Joey has fainted. Use next Pokemon. Yes. We're gonna fight with magic. Magic, you're in charge. I think it, we, we will kill it if we attack with any of those attacks. Yeah, we will. So, how many Pokeballs do we have left? We have one. This is going to be an amazing series. An amazing series. I am so excited to finally announce that I will be playing the first ever Cute Charm Shiny Heart Gold game. Thank you all so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe for more. And I will see you all in the next episode. See ya!